Sidonia, 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 why do you do this to me, Sidonia? You, you give me this episode, okay? The episode is nice. It's a nice, slow pace, relaxing episode. And then it builds up at the last, like, three to four minutes. It builds up into something very action-heavy. And then you just end it like that. Sidonia, stop grabbing me by the balls, okay? It, it sucks. I love this series. I love you, Sidonia, but don't do this shit to me. Don't do this shit to me. Thank God, at the very least, judging by the way the preview is for next week's episode, it's going to be action-packed and intense. Because when it comes to Sidonia's action-packed episodes, they're usually fucking good. Very good. Especially with the CGI, the music, the sound effects, just everything is so good when it comes to some of these action episodes of Sidonia. Because like I said, that's when Sidonia really shines with its animation and CGI. And I'm looking forward to next week because it looks like it's going to be very intense. This will be like one of our first times really getting to see how, you know, Sugumi is going to be able to fight the Chimera. How she's going to be able to fight out there. I mean, her strength and stuff like that. And to see this, I'm looking forward to seeing what is going to happen. So besides that, before I get more into that, the episode of Sidonia, episode 3. I'm glad it got translated fast. Uh, I think the series came out yesterday raw. And... The day's the next day, and it's translated. That's actually very impressive for a translation group, you know, a fan translation group. That's very impressive. So, you know, whoever translated this, I just want to say thank you so much for translating this. It sucks that, you know, Netflix had to pick the series up, and we can't watch it until the series is completely done, and they finally decide to upload it, like, months later. But thank God we have fan translations that took the time to actually translate something like this, because the translations were nice, and I got to watch my Sidonia on a Saturday, so fucking good. Now, the episode, it has a lot of cute moments to it. Like, Sugumi, she, she's growing on me. She, she's fucking growing on me. Like, oh my god, I, I never would have thought I would have said kawaii to a freaking Ghana, like a Chimera Ghana. Like, I can't believe I can say that. It, she's so damn cute. The voice actor and the way she acts is just, it's so adorable. And especially getting to see how it, it was done in this episode. Especially that space scene. I like that space scene so much. Like, one of the best moments when it came to this episode. Like, that stargazing scene when they were just out there in space. And you saw the stars. One of the best scenes of season two so far. Because that... I think that scene really goes to demonstrate the level of budget that was put into Season 2 compared to the previous season. Let me explain. Sidonia has always had a high budget when it comes to some of the action scenes. But I noticed in this episode, when it came to some of the slice of life elements or, you know, aspects of the episode... The animation was a lot better than Season 1. It was very obvious to me. But... I noticed in that one space scene, there was a lot of movement going on. And with that lot of movement going on, it seemed like the animators were kind of showcasing their ability and how much they're willing to go even further than they did than Season 1. And I liked that scene quite a bit because there was so much more movement going on. And the characters don't look as robotic as they did in Season 1, they still slightly do, but they don't look as robotic as they did. So, clearly we have some improvements going on when it comes to even the slice life elements of Sidonia. Now, getting into the sound effects. Now, usually I don't really go into depth with sound effects or, an like, sound animation, whatever. You know, just, you know, sound in general of anime besides the music. The sound effects of Sidonia is something I have truly underestimate and I remember now thinking back on season one the animation and with the sound effects really were the main shining points of the series especially getting to see how the sound effects were done with the squad formation when Sugumi went out there to attack the Ghana and the squad formation with the music placement stuff I love the sound effects right there that that was so freaking good like that right there is just some beautiful sound effects because that like ambient sequence where there's like ambience and you just see the sound effects starting up with like the, the engine starting and all that. I love that. I love that scene. I'm a big sucker for sound effects when it comes to certain specific things. Like that's why I like Karno Kyokai so much because the sound effects of certain objects being opened or doors being opened. It's just it's very realistic and it actually draws you into the world of the series. So, moving past the sound effects, the episode, it also shows us that In has finally reawoken, hopefully I said her name right, she's finally reawoken after, you know, being knocked unconscious, and we get a very funny scene in this episode, a very 
Funny scene now, it depends on your taste in comedy. I, I laugh my ass off when the poor dude, he closes the door, and he tries to walk away with, you know, the rice balls, and then you just see this door come out and slap him in the face, and his face gets crushed up against the wall, and you see blood. Of course, that's a, a comedy segment, because if that wasn't comedy, he would have died right there, but still, the dude, that comedy segment, I don't know how to feel about that. It felt very forced in some ways, but I did enjoy the after effects and when his face got crushed in, because that was just pretty unexpected, but the fan service scene, it's just, I'm iffy on that, it just, it depends on your type of comedy if you want to see fan service, so yeah, that's the episode of Sidonia, tell me your thoughts in the comments below, did you enjoy it, did you hate it, I love y'all so much, please be safe, chibi